Welcome to the Exit West Sports Network. I got breaking news for you. All right, Tyshawn Goodman has went on Twitter at Sam Turretai and he started calling out people. His first tweet was, Found my groove. I'm tired of being humble. Life is short. Playing time is shorter. Time to speak my mind. It then said a T saying, <laughs> Yawn, these receivers are overhyped, to be honest. Then he called out veteran breakout tight end Mark Andrews at mandrews underscore 81 if your family is coming to watch you make plays i'll reimburse them for their tickets after the game that is big talk coming for the rookie mark andrews has not responded but i'm pretty sure he's heard it it is all over the internet right now so without further ado let's jump into the game and let's see if tyshawn can live up to the shit he just talked that was that was that was match up first play we already on that boy mark andrews look at him coming out of the tight end spot we ran a blitz tried to run a post we're all over that oh my goodness that boy was clamped Ugh. give me that darius slay i believe oh i didn't see that guy i believe that's his sixth interception in six weeks bro darius slay oh my goodness boy who the hell is this is that supposed to be really sneaky? Nice. Let's go. He actually threw the ball. Oh, he ran that. Oh, he threw it. Okay. All right. This time we're actually matched up on Willie Sneed. He's going to run a little in route doesn't get him on the press tried to jump and help with mark andrews but he continues across kind of gives up on the play because i thought lamar jackson was going to run i mean look at all the space he had but nonetheless he makes the throw and we run willie sneed down uh probably going to be his only catch of the day jammed him up yeah <laughs> Here's the beef lined up on Mark Andrews, absolutely destroying him on the line. He can't go nowhere. Ball's already out of uh, Lamar's hands, bro. Ooh. Why would you go for the pick? Oh, come on. I got to set them to SWAT. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Woo. This time we're matched up on Willie Sneed once again. Fool me once, shame on me. Not gonna fool me twice. Tries to win the end route and we're hip right on his hip. Stride for stride. It's amazing we didn't trip up over each other. Even pushed him into the line of scrimmage. Woo hoo hoo. Look at us. Yay, clamped up. Oh, we ran into each other, but Lamar Jackson's gonna take off and he's gonna slide. They're gonna kick a field goal. Lamar Jackson misses a read as we do a roll swap here. I wanted the linebacker to cover deep and I want the man up on Mark Andrews. He releases outside and we actually get picked. So he actually had two options there had he waited, but he already decided to scramble. Yeah, he missed a touchdown on the backside. Me and I believe that's Darius Slate completely just take each other out. What? How do we get blocked by that guy? And Lamar gets hurt. Oh yeah! Tyshawn forces a fumble! And that's gonna be a pick six! That's gonna be a pick six. A strip six! Strip six, come on, Nathan Gary! That's his second touchdown of the year off of fumbles. In Gary, let's go! RG3's first play in, and he gets hit sticked, and it results in a touchdown. Let's go! Shout out to Tyshawn. That's his fourth first forced turnover. He has three picks and then that. Nice. Give me that! Tyshawn Goodman with a pick after... Oh, he could have had a pick six, but the game... Lamar Jackson throws it right to him. Let's go. Forces a fumble and then on the very next play gets a pick. Fourth interception on this season. Let's go. Right here, we line up as if it's man coverage. I'm guessing Lamar Jackson assumed I'm manned up with the running back. And yeah, fake. Well, he blocked. So whether I was manned up or not, I still would have been lurking. Staying here on the freaking drag route. And then looks like he tried. He expected me to stay on whoever 80 is. 
I don't know who Boykin is. Miles Boykin, something. Tries a lob it over our heads, but nope. We're going to get that. Looks like he tried to make a tight, tight window throw. Or maybe he just didn't see me. Yeah, I don't know what he was thinking there. But nonetheless, we get our fourth interception. And when Madden fixes a patch, we will get two fucking <laughs> pick sixes. Got to make that tackle. Let's go. And he's going to try to escape and get sacked by Fletcher Cox. Let's go. Find up on that boy again, Willie Sneed. He gets the win. Willie try to make the throw. He tries big play slay, and he's going to get a swat on fourth and fifth. Fourth and whatever that was. Big play slay coming up big today. Hasn't given up a catch, I believe. Oof. Here we are. Here we are, matched up on Mark Andrews, and he tries to run a quick out route. We're not pressed by his his upfield release at all. Waiting on it, and we're on that. Oh, man, he would have needed a perfect throw to get that. But Lamar Jackson decides to take off, though. Screen. Ugh. Jackson under pressure all day. Oh, he holds on to that? Oh, that's marking him. <laughs> yeah, not tricking him. And gets an inaccurate throw. All right, lined up on Willie Sneak. Gets the press, but runs into the linebacker. Throws me off a little bit. Waiting for him to make his cut. He breaks for a curl. Then he reroutes up the field as Lamar Jackson is scrambling, but Lamar Jackson cannot make the throw. Probably the, yeah, that's the most separation anybody has had on us so far today. And, yeah, Lamar Jackson cannot make the throw. And it's probably the only time Willie Sneed will be open for the rest of the game. <laughs> and we get a block! We blocked it! Please! Yeah! We blocked the field goal! A block turned into six. And what an absolute... Oh, my goodness. The Baltimore Ravens did not show up today. He misses the freaking hit stick. And that's gonna be a oh it's whatever it has to give him something all right that is gonna do it we're gonna destroy the baltimore ravens 42 to 10 and let's look at these stats because we cover willie sneed and mark andrews and we was talking that shit before the game so yeah let's see if we actually have something to talk crap about shout out to the d-line helped us out tremendously by getting that pressure bro Woof. look at it Willie Sneed actually end up catching three balls for 47 yards. I don't believe... No, he had one catch against us, which should have been his biggest one of the day. Yeah, he had one 28-yard reception. I don't think that 28-yard was on us. I think he got 10... To, I don't know. So, Willie Sneed, three for 47, only had one catch on us. But as for Mark Andrews, completely out of the game. Not on the stat sheet whatsoever. So, hey, we talked that shit and we backed it up. Let's go. All right, I'll catch y'all on the next one. If you know, man, because we know we up next. Yeah, I'm up.